And we're back in uh, part two of course correction. And uh, looking around trying to uh, refuel the Ishimura so that we don't crash into uh, HS7 hello and all die. I suppose that would be the, the assumed outcome if I could not get things running again. Uh, so we're just taking a look around here, see if there's anything that, uh, that we want. And I'm just kicking this poor ragdoll dead dude around. And that is a stasis pack, which is useless to me since my inventory is full. Uh, so let's go back to the uh, not terribly practical kinesis module switch and uh, get the fuel going. Refueling sequence activated. Sufficient fuel to fire primary engine. Whatever you did, it's working, Isaac. I have a fuel reading. It's only a quarter full, but that's enough to restore orbit once you bring the engines online. What the hell? Oh, false alarm. I thought I saw something. Well, Hammond, you're crazy. If I remember correctly, I am about to be assaulted by three zombie toddlers, and... Yep! There we go! Whoa! Hello! No. No hugs. Hugs bad. <laughs> oh, boy. What I want? Uh-oh. Uh Again, running back so that they can only attack from one direction. Oh, there's two of them. That is exceptionally unpleasant. God damn you. Alright. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Plasma energy. Small air can. That would probably be useful. I don't know. Actually, let's just hit a... Get a health pack and then grab one. Squish, squish, squish. Again, Isaac is wandering around looking scared as hell. Yeah, can you can you blame the guy? The answer is no. You cannot blame the guy. He's doing better than I would be in his situation. Uh, go across the divide here before anything else horrible shows up to tear my face off. Man, the fog machine is really working overtime down here. Alright, what's well, waiting for me? Whatever, dude, it's noisy. What? No, you come back here. Or, you know, just run off. Wait to. Ambush me around a corner, that's fine too, I guess. You know, to each his own. <sighs> I think you're doing alright, yep. Okay. It's just a, just a saw blade. Perfectly, perfectly safe saw blade. This is weird, he totally ran up this way, but there's nobody here. This is just going to be farther up, waiting to kill me. Oh, is that really necessary? I think I'm just going to have to like start delimbing people as I uh, find their corpses. There's a really morbid thought. Can they open doors? Let's find out. It, it definitely seems to be trying to get in. Or out, as the case may be, I suppose. Can't say I'm really inclined to uh, let him out, but I, I, I do have to get in there. Uh, let's get this over with. Why are you running? Holy crap. Oh. 
Okay, I think I got him. Yeah, I think I think I'm just gonna start delimbing all the corpses <laughs> that I find lying around. That uh, that makes things any more convenient. Though I, though I wonder, you know, will the uh, will the corpse respawn as having all of its proper body parts? Just kind of a, you know, oh, you're gonna have to fight this guy, whether you want to or not. All right, let's sell some stuff at the store here, because as we all know, it's very important to uh, have lots of money acquired in, uh, in the future when you're alone on a spaceship and everything's trying to kill you. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and sell the air can. So I, think, I think I'll be alright. I mean, I haven't run into a situation yet where I've really needed one. Although there really was only that one section, and that was about it. So I may be regretting that in the very near future. But, uh... Just gonna save here again so I don't have to do that little errand. Yes, I would. Alright. So we've got the ship fueled, but now we need to reactivate the gravity uh, something. Whatever it was that, uh, that keeps the artificial gravity working. Hmm. Whoa! Oh, jeez! <laughs> Whoops, my bad. Whatever it is that keeps the artificial, uh, not the artificial gravity, but, uh, but what keeps the ship able to keep its orbit above the planet, I think. Oh, oh no. I told you, I told you guys, someday this would happen be an event, or I'd be in an elevator, these things would all drop down on me at once, and that would just be it. Gravity centrifuge, travel equipment, all our... Thank you. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Anything interesting up here? No. Another air can. Hmm. Maybe there is a, a. Well, when you're dealing with a gravity environment, there probably is some sort of zero g thing in the very near future. Ooh, audio log. This is Temple. Now the centrifuge is offline. We've got four trillion tons of rock hanging off our ass, and without that centrifuge to balance the ship, the gravity tethers will pull us straight down to the colony. I'm heading in there now to see if I can fix it. Well, I'm gonna guess he wasn't uh, very successful either, since, you know, we're still falling. Plasma. Pulse rounds. Ooh. Plasma. I'm all full up. Line racks. Don't care since I don't have a line gun. Ooh, let's upgrade our plasma cutter a little more. Let's go for damage. I'm sure that'll make dealing with those uh, super morphs or whatever the heck they are uh, a little easier. Those guys can obviously take uh, a few more shots to the, uh, the joints than regular old necromorphs can. Huh. Well, a big open room. Oh, a decontamination chamber. There's no way this is not a trap. Oh, boy. Oh, look at all the vents. All right. Let's get it over with. Decontamination sequence activated. Please stand by. Yep. I knew it. Or maybe it's just the decontamination sequence. No, that's definitely a necromorph. Oh, hello. How am I supposed to get my suit clean? Can you guys wait until the decontamination's over? Oh. Never mind. It's the quarantine. 
All right. Who's first? Oh, you are. Shoot. One. Is that it? No, evidently it's not. Anyone else want to come into the contamination chamber? I guess so. Whoa! He's still pretty accurate without a head. <laughs> I, I, I misspoke earlier there, but I guess it, it sort of is a contamination chamber at this point. Decontamination sequence dead complete. necromorphs everywhere. Thank you for your patience. Oh, anytime, disembodied voice. Disappointing. Go through all that and don't get really anything to share for your trouble, except you know, <laughs> chance to keep breathing. Oh boy, there's not a single working light in here. That's cool. Don't go alone. Take assurance. It's not sure if that's supposed to be comforting. Mm. In that case, let's check down here. It's generally a good idea to go in the opposite direction of wherever the goal is, at least to start off with, because there might be something valuable. Then again, there might not. That is gross. Mine. No, I really don't want to get close to it. It's, it's moving. It's got moving things in it. All right. Take the pet. Take the note, damn it. All right. Oh, that wasn't so bad. And now let's go the other way. And if I remember correctly, there should be a save point up here. Somewhere in the very near future. Oh, that doesn't look good. There's another hole like that in a uh, medical bay. That's how the uh, morphs are getting around. You know, when they're not obviously using the vents. Ooh, cool, it's in a conductor. Oh, what? Inventory full? Don't give me this garbage. Alright, what can I afford to lose here? Oh, I have a surplus of plasma energy. Let's go ahead and drop that. Yes, I realize I'm actively sacrificing ammunition for profit. But just think of all the things I could buy. G environment, we know where this goes. Okay, I'm going to uh, save here and quit out and get ready for the uh, next recording. So until then, stay away from the vents.